In our Undiet program, we don't push you to exercise, especially in the beginning. Often people starting out on a weight loss journey become so overwhelmed with trying to get their diet in order and trying to stay on top of exercising. Personally, I didn't start moving until I had lost about 60 pounds and by that time I wasn't thinking so much about food, I was wanting to move more. We utilize the 80-20 rule here in just about everything. The saying that abs are made in the kitchen is true, or that other one about how you can't outrun a bad diet, also true. Food is 80% of your success, and with food, 80% of it being best choices, leaving room for 20% of fun, fringe, or outlying times. I address that more though in the program. Um, I do recommend moving, but you don't need to overdo it. For me, moving was about mental health. The phrase use it or lose it always comes to mind for me. If I stop moving, especially as I age, I won't be able to move at all. And I do not want that for my future. Anyway, eventually I will recommend it, but you're also going to want to do it. So how can you establish and stick to a routine? So first and foremost, let's address the elephant in the room, okay? Many of us find find it challenging to form new habits and exercise is really no exception. But remember that consistency is key, just consistency. It's just like brushing your teeth or taking a shower, exercise should become a part of your daily routine. So to establish a workout routine, start by getting or setting realistic goals. Don't aim for a bodybuilder's physique in a week. Instead, set small achievable targets. And think about the snowball that I so often talk about. It starts with the smallest pinch of snow and as you roll it, it gets bigger and bigger and bigger. For instance, you could commit to exercising 30 minutes a day, five days a week. That's it. Next, find an activity that you enjoy. If you hate running, don't do it. There are countless exercises to choose from, such as swimming, cycling, dancing, or yoga. The key is to find something that you look forward to. It's also crucial to schedule your workouts. Block off specific times in your calendar for exercise, just the same way that you would for any other important appointment. This will help you prioritize your health and make it harder to skip a workout. This is what I did too, and I still do it. Now, let's talk about sticking to your routine. Accountability is a significant factor here. If you aren't coaching with us, share your goals with friends or join a fitness community. Having someone to cheer you on and hold you accountable can make all the difference. I need somebody to hold me accountable in every way, still to this day. Lastly, be prepared for and expect setbacks. Life happens and there will be days where you simply can't stick to your routine. So don't beat yourself up about it. Instead, just get back on track as soon as possible and remember that consistency is what matters the most. If you would like any information about any of our health and lifestyle coaching packages, check out our website at beamyhealth.ca or email us at info at beamyhealth.ca. Have a great day.